My name is Aaliyah Manning. My parents are Maria and Trisha Manning. I'm here because of them. Especially my dad, he... He dedicated his life to the foundation, and now I have the opportunity to do the same. During my time here, I want to be the best that I can be. I want to meet interesting people and learn interesting things, and I want to help the Foundation keep the world safe. And if this is really just for me, I want to... I want to find out what happened to my dad. I want to become important enough, or smart enough, or powerful enough to find out why he disappeared. <laughs> My mom won't tell me. And I know she knows because she, she changed when I asked her. And I knew I wasn't supposed to ask, that's just... life in the foundation. He was my best friend. And ever since he's been gone, everything has just gotten worse. Like, ever. I don't know. I want to help people. That's what I want to do here. I, I'm not exactly sure how yet, but that's what I want to do. That, that's what I'm going to do. Why? Cadet William Dennison reporting for day one of video journaling. <clears throat> I'm here proudly representing the best of Broken Oak, North Carolina. I was recruited by Commander Butkus after the Foundation got word of my uh, killing an alien. I killed a dead with my bare hands and a pitchfork. Plus, this beats the shit out of that work camp program I was stuck in, so I figured, why not? Um, oh, uh, for my intentions, I will become the best of the best of the best. I will protect the helpless. I will show no fear in the face of danger. I will be the boogeyman to all the monsters of the darkness. Hoorah! I'm all done in here. Once complete, press the stop button located to the right of the door. Please note this will work. Oh, shit. Hello. My name is Kelly H. Blackwood. I understand the prompt states rather explicitly that these journal entries are considered private, but I'd like it known that I don't believe that for a second, and I will approach this routine accordingly. My background. I was approached by special contact Gerard Henderson on the 21st of June this past year. 
I was shown a mostly blank book, save the title on the first page, immediately fell asleep and had an excellent dream about my would-be presidential campaign. On my inauguration day, I was approached by a man in a green cloak who told me I was destined for something much greater than politics. When I woke up, Henderson handed me a contract that already had my name on it. I accepted and now I'm here. My intentions and goals within the organization. After studying your program structure, I've identified my preferred specialty in the administrative tract and my parallel specialties in reality mechanics and safe class research. I know I don't need to fully enroll into those programs until my third year, but it's never too late for an early start. Now, after advancing out of the program with the highest marks of any student, I plan to ascend the ranks of the administrative branch and ultimately become chief commissioner of the ethics committee. I will be in charge one day. And the first thing I'm going to do is complete the renovations of this facility. This building is atrocious. I've seen past your very thin veneer, and I must say, how do you expect to exude power when you can't even keep paint from peeling off the walls? <clears throat> Regardless, seeing as I've completed your prescribed set of prompts, I will end my entry here. Thank you for your time.